What's up guys, it's SonicGX98, and today we're going to be talking about Tales from the Borderlands. So, just today, um, Telltale released several screenshots for um, Episode 3, Catch a Ride, along with a release date uh, for June 23rd, which is the same day Batman Arkham Knight comes out. So, we're just going to go through the screenshots now, along with the tweets that came with them, and see what we can discover from them. Alright, so the first screenshot we got here is of Reese and Fiona inside of the Gordas facility after the end of episode 2. Telltale Company, this screenshot of the tweet, who did you trust in the Gordas facility? Now, obviously this screenshot is if you chose to side with Handsome Jack at the end of episode with Reese taking control of the turret, so... Not much else we can see from this except for the fact that, um, Fiona is wondering what Reese is doing. His eyes change his color, what we've seen in Reese in the future, so I wonder how, if you side with Handsome Jack, how that's gonna affect this. This next screenshot we've got here is of um, the whole gang riding away on Loaderbots with the caption, Catch a Ride with Loaderbot in Tales of the Borderlands Episode 3. So, based on this clip, we know that Vaughn and Sasha, who we thought were um, in a pretty um, precarious position at the end of Episode 2, we know they'll survive. Um, so the, the whole gang apparently is like they're going to escape the facility of Loaderbot with the Gordas core intact. Here's a third screenshot we have um, with the caption, Ruthless Criminal Queenpin Valerie is in pursuit in Tales from the Borderlands Episode 3. So right here we've got the splash card for Valerie. We already know this was Valerie based on file leaks from Episodes 1 and 2. But we got her splash card right here. We have Valerie the Queenpin. So it seems like Valerie's going to be like a main antagonist for maybe the rest of the season. We know from Episode 2 that August is working for Valerie, so we're wondering how um, she's going to play a role in this episode. The next screenshot we have right here is of Reese and Sasha riding on loader bots in what appears to be some sort of jungle looking area. Telltale captioned this picture, Explore the jungle of an Atlas terraforming facility in Tales from the Borderlands Episode 3. So from here it looks like maybe Reese and Sasha are in this Atlas facility looking for some sort of maybe escape or maybe they're running away from Valerie or something. Who knows what we've got here. The next screenshot is pretty interesting, um, Telltale captioned it with, Be ready to get your hands dirty in Tales from the Borderlands Episode 3, Catch Your Eye. So in this shot we have Reese, like, um, I'm not sure how to put this, Reese, it looks like he's climbing on some sort of bandit truck or something with Loaderbot trying to stop it, and we see, um, the Gordas Corps running away from both of them. So maybe August groups or Valerie catches up to Reese and Loaderbot, this could be a direct continuation of the last screenshot we have with Reese and Sasha. And looks like maybe they're trying to get the Gordas core before Valerie does. Now this last screenshot is what interests me the most. Here we have um, Fiona and Athena surrounded by two unknown characters with the screen caption, What is Fiona facing in Tales from the Borderlands Episode 3 and who is Athena working for? Find out starting June 23rd. So, from this glance, some people might assume that this is Finch and Kroger who were chasing Fiona and, and Sasha in Episode 2. But what I noticed is... If you look on the, the carriage on the left, the arm very resembles that of Rick from Borderlands 2. Um, now, if, it, if you've played Tales from Borderlands Episode 2, you know that in the Episode 3 teaser they showed at the end of the episode that Brick is in it. So, we know he's definitely in it, this could be when he could be showing up. And as for the figure on the right, he's got the red and black pants shirt thing down, so a lot of people could assume this is either Finch or Kroger, but to me, it looks actually more like Mordecai, who is known to wear a similar outfit. Now, it could be possible that Brick and Mordecai are working together for some reason, I don't know why. Um, these could be slight spoilers for Borderlands the pre-sequel, but in the beginning of Borderlands the pre-sequel, Athena is captured by Lilith, Mordecai, and Brick and is questioned by them, and she basically narrates the whole story of the pre-sequel. So, and at the end of it, Athena is rescued from the three of them by the alien creature that was shown in the beginning of the pre-sequel. So, it could be possible that Brick and Mordecai are trying to track down Athena and kill her, and so, since they see where Fiona, they're gonna get, she, they think she's gonna get in their way too, and so they can have to take down both of them. So, that about wraps up the screenshot analysis. Um, what are you guys, what are you guys' thoughts on the screenshots? Leave your comments below, and I'll see you guys later.